own Tom Simon, and you're watching The Big Topic tonight. The Big Topic, American Idol, the top ten performed Billy Joel. Um, wow, and you know, all these songs are from when I was a kid. I remember watching Billy Joel when I was a kid and dreaming that I could marry somebody like his ex-wife. <laughs> um, you know, but... I love Billy Joel, and I love the performances tonight. There were so many good performances tonight. Tonight, uh, Tommy Hilfiger uh, helped with the styling and, and the image to help get, uh, you know, some people took his advice, some people didn't, but um, he did a good job advising these people. Uh, P. Diddy was in the house to help advise on the singing portion uh, with Jimmy, and together they tag-teamed the contestants to get them ready for their performances. Uh, tonight, the top ten. Uh, let's get it started. First with Joshua Ledet. Uh, Joshua, well, you know, I'm not going to talk about these in any order. I'm just going to talk about them. So Joshua Ledet, I'm going to talk about first. Um, and he's saying she's got away. And uh, I thought he had a little bit, a few problems connecting with the song a little bit um, in the beginning. And then when, in you know, when the at the end, he started kind of singing a lot better, in my opinion. I don't think this was Joshua Ledet's best performance, but there's no taking away from how amazing his voice is. Um, that's all. I'm, I think he can do better. I really think he can do better than I. And I think it had mostly to do with the fact, and he said it himself, that he it was kind of a poppy song to him, and he sings soul. And, you know, and that's what happened. He just, he didn't connect with that song as much as he would a soulful song. Doesn't mean he sang bad. He just didn't do the best he can do in my eyes. Still love Joshua Ledet. Fantastic voice. And just because I say he didn't do the best he could do, doesn't mean it wasn't great. It was still great performance. It was still great performance. I enjoyed it. Uh, next, I'm going to talk about Hee Joo Hun. Hee Joo Hun uh, did My Life and... I have to be honest, this is the first time I actually heard Hee Joo Hun's accent a little bit. And I think the reason why is he wasn't being so serious. Now, Hee Joo did a good job. Uh, in As far as the performance goes, I was entertained. He had a lot of fun. I had fun with it. I enjoyed it. And, you know, it was kind of like his get back at the judges for last week, them being a little hard on him or criticizing him constructively. Um... Uh, you know, he, he kind of, with my life, he, 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 you know, he said, oh, well, it's my life. I don't care what you think. I'm going to do what I want. It's my life. And that's kind of what he did tonight. Uh, but he did still put the performance in. So I thought he had a good performance. And I was entertained. Dev, I would vote for you, Heeju, and I enjoyed it. But as far as the vocals went tonight, uh, you have to admit, they were not as good as everybody else tonight. I'm sorry, Heeju. Um... But the performance was great, so you are an entertainer. Now, I know from history that the best entertainers ever to live were not always the best singers. They were a combination of everything. They could sing, they could dance, and, you know, that's what I see Hugh June. He's a performer, an entertainer, and I think he has a career ahead of him doing that if he works hard at it. Um, next, I'm going to talk about Jessica Sanchez. Uh, she went second to last tonight. She did a Everybody Has a Dream, and she looked beautiful. Tommy really hooked her up in, in styling. And basically, I have to say that Jessica Sanchez tonight was flawless, perfect. This voice is so beautiful. There were times when she started singing, and just the chills run through the body with her because her voice is that incredible. It's beautiful. She was born with a voice. God gave her a gift, and she's using it. Jessica Sanchez, great performance tonight. You were incredible. Uh, DeAndre Brack, I'm going to talk about Holly Kavanaugh, actually, first. Um, Honesty is the song she sang, and she, she has a beautiful voice to me. Uh, the judges said she was a little pitchy here and there. I didn't quite hear the pitchiness, but I did hear uh, the confidence and I don't think it was her most confidence, confident performance. Even though she still sounded beautiful, she has a beautiful voice. She looked beautiful. She had some white bell bottoms on, some sequins in the shirt. Looked incredible. But the performance, 
I don't think she was feeling it, uh, this song, as much as she did some of her other songs. Uh, still a good performance, so I think t next week uh, I hope to see her bring it up like she normally does in her other songs. So, not her best performance, still beautiful voice, still sounded good to me. I didn't hear the pitchiness too much, but I did hear something in her voice that just wasn't uh, perfect like always with, with, with um, Holly Kavanaugh. So, still did a good job, Holly. Um, but, you know, I hope that people vote for you. I, I like you. I think you're a great singer. Uh, DeAndre Brackensick, um, we're going to talk about him. Uh, basically, he did Only the Good, uh, Only the Good Die Young. Uh, he let his hair out. Looked good. Tommy was right on that. I thought his hair looked great out. I enjoyed it. He has a great voice. This was a good, safe performance for DeAndre Brackensick, and I think he's going to make it through. Um, it wasn't his best performance that I've ever heard, but it wasn't bad by no means. I mean, it was just a good performance. It wasn't great out of the box. Wow, I'm just like, woo, woo, woo. But it was good performance. I enjoyed it. It was still show quality, um, concert quality, and still a good performance by DeAndre Brackensick. Uh, a little more about that. He had me bouncing. He had me snapping my fingers. So I, I changed my mind. It was a great performance. I enjoyed it. Erica Van Pelt, New York State of Mind is the song she sang by Billy Joel. Uh, tonight is Billy Joel night. This is, you know, and, and basically, uh, she, Erica Van Pelt did what she normally does. She looked good. She cut her hair, um, and Tommy said she should cut her hair short, uh, dyed it black, so it used to be kind of strawberry streaks in blonde, and now it's chopped, cut, Cut all the hair off, chopped, and then basically uh, dyed black. And she looked, at first it looked weird to me because I'm used to her with the strawberry uh, blonde streaks, or the strawberry streaks with the blonde. And now we see her with short black hair. I was like, do I like it? Do I like it? By the end of the song, it fit her really well. And definitely a good choice to cut the hair. It fit her. It fit her, as did the song. She did a good job. Great voice tonight. I enjoyed her. Uh, Philip Phillips, one of the performances of the, uh, performances of the night for me. Uh, there were three that were performances of the night. Um, Philip Phillips came out tonight, uh, moving out. Now, Diddy and, uh, uh, basically told him, you know, and Jimmy told him to lose the guitar, you know, to, to don't, don't use the guitar. And then Tommy told him, that you need a lot of help with your with your styling. You, that's a, you said you need help. And basically, uh, he told him not to wear gray. Uh, well, Philip Phillips comes out, and he is Philip Phillips. He, be, he, he He's himself. He uses the guitar. He wears gray on top of gray. And then he also has gray eyes, if you look closely. Uh, Gray-blue eyes. And this guy is a magis musician. He's a performer. And he sang incredibly. He did Moving Out. And... It was incredible. I was grooving the whole time. I was loving the growls that he did. He was just like, oh, uh. you know, it was an incredible performance by Phil Phillips. One of the performances of the night. He was incredible, along with Jessica Sanchez. Um, I would put Phil Phillips and Jessica Sanchez as the best performances of the night. And there's one more. I'm sorry, two more. There were four performances, honestly, that just wowed me. Um, next, we're going to talk about Elise Testone. This performance was incredible. She does in Vienna, and this girl has been in the bottom three the last three weeks in a row. What is wrong with you, America? After tonight, I mean, don't hide your body, your beautiful, voluptuous body. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Tommy had that right. You know, show it. You look incredible. You sing incredible. Your tone is incredible. I love that growliness of the voice. The you know, it's so beautiful, Elise. Um, you're, you're, I mean, I, I love you. It was gorgeous. It was incredible. That rasp was just wonderful. She got standing ovations from the crowd, from me, from everybody. Had me with chills through the whole song. Brilliant performance. Another one of the performances of the night. Next, uh, Skylar Lane, she's a little starstruck by Diddy. Um, she did Shameless. Uh, and I'm going to be honest, she, she sang well, 
but it was not her best performance for me. I thought she did, you know, many songs a lot better than this. Um, and I love Shameless. You know, I love the Garth Brooks version as well. And she, you know, she did the country version. It was good. It was good. It was just not great for me. It wasn't the best I've heard, you know, of Skylar Lane. I know Skylar Lane. Some parts I thought she was yelling too much. I'm just being honest. Still think Skylar Lane is good. Um, but that's what I think about her performance. I thought she was yelling a little bit too much on this, and it could have been better. Colton Dixon. <laughs> uh, wow, man. This dude was brilliant tonight. Brilliant. He did Piano Man. He played the piano. He looked like a rock star. Um, it was beautiful. There were parts in his voice. I'm trying to figure what kind of... It, it echoed. It, it was just like... It was like, oh, and, and it would echo and sound almost like that dolphin-like lo location kind of sound coming out. It was beautiful. Freaking beautiful. Uh, all the judges loved it. I loved it. It was amazing. Colton Dixon, one of the performances of the night tonight, and he really was a rock star. He did Billy Joel proud, and he just killed this song tonight. So that's basically it for the top ten performing Billy Joel tonight. Uh, the top four performances for me were Elise Testone, Philip Phillips, um, Jessica Sanchez, and uh, Colton Dixon. They killed it tonight. Um, if you are a fan, like even of Joshua Ledette, you know, he was great tonight. Uh, just not his best in my opinion, but he was still great. Um, you got to vote for him because he's already been on the bottom once, and I didn't understand the last time he was on the bottom, so I'm scared they might put him on the bottom again. I don't know why. I think he deserves to be in this competition till the end. He has that good of a voice. So if you like somebody, vote for him. And vote for Elise Testone. She is awesome. I mean, after tonight, she's just incredible. I want to buy your record. Elise, Philip Phillips, Colton Dixon, and... Jessica Sanchez, I want your record tonight. Right now. You guys were incredible. Thanks for watching the big topic, American Idol, uh, Billy Joel Songs Night. And uh, good night.